Hi everyone, welcome to Straight From The Divine Tarot. We're gonna do another collective for today. This is Monday, April 25th, 2022, although it is timeless. It's for whenever you come across this video. Um, if you like the video, please like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you know when I upload. And uh, just go through it quickly. I don't use gender because we have both male and female within us, and I don't use the signs because we embody those energies all the time throughout our lives, depending on the situation. So based on the reading, if the reading is for you, you will know who's who uh, just by the description. So take what applies, toss the rest. Don't try to make it fit into your world. If it doesn't, it's not a good idea. If I use the pronouns he and she, it's only because it's on the cards and it's to keep it straight in my head. And yeah, here we go. I'm gonna get an oracle card, spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, the white light. What is your message for the collective for today, please? The message for the collective for today. Thank you. We have the well watcher, wisdom, power of the divine, number seven, lucky number seven, wisdom. So higher wisdom, right? It's beautiful. Oh, uh, cards. Let's use these ones. All right, spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, light light. What are your messages for the collective today for Monday? Oh, what's this? Oh, oh, look at this. I have a straight card in here. The sword and rose, clarity, truth, revelation, solidarity, force, honor, protection, power. Wow. Power of the divine. How How's that for a coinky dink? I'll leave that up there, obviously. Okay, thank you. Oh, there's another one. Okay, I didn't uh, put these away properly. Talking, interested, conversing more, awaited message arrives, text, call, email, hoovering. So watch out, it could be a narcissist. All right, if you get a phone call today or a message, spirit guides, guardian angels, can we do this again now? Is that it? <laughs> you guys are sneaky. Uh, what are your messages for the collective today for Monday, April? 25th, 2022, please. What would you like them to know? Okay. Can I cut the, the deck here, spirit? spirit? A little crazy here at the energy. <laughs> it's like excitement. Um, it's not a bad feeling. Trust me, it's not. Okay. So we have wands. Ace of wands in reverse. Uh, maybe somebody's feeling powerless at this moment here. No new beginnings. Um, not feeling the passion. Maybe feeling weak. Um, no growth where they are, possibly. Let's see where it goes. Could be an STD, so let's see where it goes. Uh, this is the Six of Pentacles in reverse. So somebody was, something's not balanced here. It's out of whack. Uh, somebody could have used and abused a person, maybe, breadcrumbed them. It could have been fraud and or criminal activity. Or they're just hurting for money. That's the bottom of the deck, sorry. Ace of Wands in Reverse Spirit. Why is this here? Ace of Wands in Reverse, please. For the collective, why is this here? Ace of Wands, please. Spirit Guides, Guardian Angels, Ancestors, the White Light. Thank you, Spirit. Queen of Swords. Oof. Well, she knows her boundaries, and I say her the only because of the, the, the photo. It could be a heat. Somebody has set boundaries, spoken their truth here. This is somebody that's very discerning, intelligent, wise, in, intuitive, um, uh, built-in inner lie, lie detector, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, she got her position, and I say her loosely, could be he, because um, they've been, they, they've been, you know, they know how it goes, right? They've been through it before. That they're, They could come across as very um, cold, apathetic, but they're not. They're very careful, okay? They know the score. They've been through it before. Um, it could be a professional. It could be a doctor, lawyer, police officer, investigator, judge. It could be anybody in those fields. It doesn't have to be. It could be just somebody speaking their truth. They're very sharp of tongue as well. So be careful. If they detect you lie, or you, you're lying, she or he will take that sword and cut you right out, okay? You'll have to feel full force of their, their acerbic tongue. Yeah, they don't suffer fools gladly. Um, oh, we got the six of wands here. This is victory, reward, recognition. Could even be fame, somebody in the public eye. 
Somebody set boundaries. Somebody's told the truth, possibly. Somebody's feeling weak. They can't go on. They're powerless now. Somebody told the truth about something. And they could be getting recognition for it. Queen of Swords in here. All right, why is she here, please? For the collective. Monday, April 25th, 2022. Please, thank you. That flew right out. Wow. Eight of Swords. Okay. Somebody's stuck in their head. Possibly. Mm. Unable to get something off their mind. Feeling constricted. Uh, restricted. This could be looming jail. This could be a judge, right? Or a lawyer. This could be uh, somebody facing jail or some sort of rest uh, restriction put upon them. Somebody stuck in their head, overthinking. Let's see, bottom of the deck. Here, fit reverse. Okay, this could be a crime. It certainly could. It could be a abuse. Uh, somebody thinking they're above the law. It could be a divorce even, a uh, separation. Uh, somebody that's non-committal. Uh, God complex. Didn't listen to uh, advice. Didn't take advice, you know, didn't listen to anybody. Just went their own way and screwed up. This could go with no faith. Somebody has no faith in somebody. It could be uh, remanded, no bail. It, take it as it applies, right? They're powerless. Maybe they're not going to get bail if they are in trouble with the law. Um, the, the courts maybe have no faith in them returning for trial. Who knows? Let's see, Eight of Swords in the upright, please, for this uh, collective. Ooh. Jeez Louise, okay, that kind of flew out, so two came out. Oh, hangman in reverse. This isn't a breast, possibly. Oh, yeah. This is, um, maybe there's an awareness now. It doesn't have to be. But somebody was struggling with something. There's no more struggle. Maybe there was a, a resisting arrest charge. People are seeing the truth. Someone's seeing the truth. Um, waste of time. This is time waster. Okay. This is a punishment card, by the way. It's a treason card, right? And then we have the hermit. Oh, boy. They could be getting... It doesn't need to be um, jail. It could be confined elsewhere, if you know what I mean. Somebody, uh, they were there hiding something. They were cloaking something, the hermit in the upright. Or somebody held a light up to, to show something, to, to, to bring light to a situation. Usually in other decks, you'll see the hermit holding a lantern over a snake. So, yeah, the snake was discovered. See this little cr critter here? The snakes are discovered in a situation, possibly. Or they're trying to hide. Take it as it applies. Bottom of the deck, what do we have here? Wow. Fall from grace, nine of cups in reverse. Somebody could have lost their position, been replaced. This is no, not emotionally fulfilling, whatever this is. It could be addictions, drinking, drugs, um, somebody that's smug and full of themselves and selfish, very, very gluttonous, um, a show-off and a know-it-all. Definite fall from grace. Could be a professional, I don't know. Somebody in their job, maybe they they know what's coming, right? An arrest here. They're trying to hide something. Let's see where this goes. Hermit in the upright for the collective, please. That's, oopsie. Okay. <laughs> it's weird how they're coming out today. Knight of Cups in reverse. This is somebody that's very insincere. <laughs> they smile in your face and lie through their teeth. All right. If it's a relationship, it's somebody that's sleeping around. It's a bed hopper. Oh, yeah. They make promises. They never keep them. They, they'll, they'll pursue you, whether it's a relationship or anything else. They'll keep pursuing you until they get what they want, and then they're gone, okay? If it is a relationship, it's sex without love or emotion. They're very immature. It's nothing, I mean, this is an energy you don't want to, you can't trust that energy. Lovers, there's a choice of two possibly, right? Lovers in the upright. There's a choice here. And this is a card of consequences, right? This person's heart's closed off. See, the key is, is, is at a distance here. Wow. Yeah, this is a card of consequence. So no matter what decision is being made here, someone's going to get their heart broken. Bottom of the deck. It doesn't have to be about relationships. It obviously is a decision, okay? King of Pentacles. Wow, it could be corruption. 
Yeah, this is uh, somebody that's very materialistic and greedy. All they think about is money. They, they do not value uh, love. They don't value anything except for themselves and gaining. They're very um, preoccupied with their image and how they come across in front of people and what they own, who's hanging off their arm. You know what I mean? It's all an act. It's all for show. It's all bullshit, okay? They try to come across as stable, secure, um, uh, successful, balanced. They're not. It's very greedy. Uh, they're jealous. They're jealous of other people, okay? They're very slimy and slick, and they're, they're lazy. They're bad with money. That's the bottom of the deck. Yeah, something's come to an end here. A permanent ending, a profound ending. Could be... Illegal gains from a death, okay? I don't want to scare anybody, but that could be. Okay, why is the King of Pentacles in reverse here? The lovers in the upright, the King of Pentacles in reverse. So this person has relationships just for money here. Yeah, these relationships with this person is con conditional, okay, on, on what they can get. And then when they get it as much as they can, buy... They ghost you. King of Pentacles in reverse. What is this here, please, for the collective? Thank you, Spirit. Six of Cups in the upright. Okay. Um, somebody might want to reconcile with you. Maybe want to take you out for a few drinks and get you a little woozy to get back into your life. You know, this kind of looks like a waitress, right? Carrying drinks. Be careful if you're drinking around this person, if you know who this is. Because um, maybe they ripped you off in the past, okay? This is also a card of the past. Or they're not paying child support. This is also for children as well. We'll see where this goes. Bottom of the deck. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This is the Six of Wands. So somebody's being exposed. Six of Wands in reverse. Somebody's being exposed. This is not a, um, a success here. This could be public humiliation. Maybe they want to get you drunk and humiliate you um, and then blackmail you. This is a bad card, okay? I mean, like I don't mean the actual card. I mean the person's, person's just bad luck, bad news. Don't have anything to do with them. 6-6, six, six, if that uh, resonates with you, this, could, this reading could be for you. Six of Cups in the upright. Thank you. Page of Swords. They're watching. Okay, Page of Swords. This is an internet card. This is the spying card. This could be... Um, Communication from a distance as well. Or it could be an investigation. All right. So this is somebody's watching most likely. Maybe they want to film you, get you drunk, film you. Put, you know, revenge porn. That does, yep. Yeah. Ooh. Well, this is death, okay? for Maybe they want to, they're watching you. Uh, death in the upright here. You've changed possibly. Um, there is an empty crib here. Somebody is pregnant here. Oh, boy. Maybe there is a loss of a child and there's an investigation. I don't know. Let's see where this goes. I hope not. Page of Swords in the Upright. Or maybe they lied about being pregnant in the past. Try to sucker you in. Again, I mean, it's just because it's a male, what seems to be a male on the on the card, it doesn't need to be a male. It could be a female, all right? Just with those characteristics, greedy and corrupt, right? Why is the Page of Swords here in the Upright for the collective, please? Thank you. Yeah. Corruption, um, thinking they're above the law here, fit in reverse. There's a maybe a divorce or a separation, non uh, committal, uh, refusing to go to therapy, maybe not showing up for court. Now there's an investigation. I take it as it applies, right? Yeah, the sun, there's clarity here. Sun, bottom of the deck, sun in the upright. There's clarity, there's truth, or somebody's healthy. I don't know. This could be healthy and happy. Um, and they just, there's a, there's a realization here about something. Oops, sorry. I, I keep doing that. Um, I'm 
Maybe there's an understanding now. I don't know why um, I'm saying that, but let's see. Why is the Hierophant Reverse, please? Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, the white light. Why is the Hierophant Reverse? No faith, no faith. Um, nine of Wands. Is this Nine of Wands? <laughs> These cards are hard to tell sometimes. Yeah, Nine of Wands. This is a um, wounded warrior. This is somebody that's persevered through some trying times here. They overcame it, though. And see this big, uh, I think we call it a sickle. Yeah, it's over with. I've had enough. That's what this energy is saying. Screw you, I've had enough. Cutting it all down. I don't know. It's, it could be emotional wounding as well. Bottom of the deck, two of wands at a crossroads. Wanting to move forward, needing to make a decision on which path they're going to take. There could be emotional wounding. That's why this person does what they do, okay? Um, just that, bear that in mind. There are guns in this photo, and I just that just hit me right now. This could be somebody in a, in a corrupt, corrupt lifestyle. I would stay away from them. Maybe they're trying to find a way to get back into your world. Um, we'll see where this goes. I see nine of wands here in the upright, please. Clarify. Thank you. Okay, that came out too. Oh, that came out again. Yeah, nine of wands in reverse. Okay, this person's very uh, egotistical and conceited. Uh, very hot-headed, confrontational, argumentative, hard to get along with, okay? They take credit for other people's work ideas and accomplishments. They just take other people's things. They don't give a shit. They think their shit don't stink. They're, they'll run you right over, right? They're very impulsive. They don't give a shit. I don't like this energy at all. Whew. I'm feeling the heat from that. Again, this card came out. Uh, it's the two of wands at a crossroads, right? I'm trying to find a way in. Maybe they're holding back. This could also mean holding back. Because you cut something, you cut them out of their out of your life, obviously. Or they're holding back, or they've been cut down somehow, maybe in a court of law. I don't know. At a crossroads, maybe the, the higher ups in the court of law, you know, the powers that be, are trying to make a decision how we're going to proceed with this. Bottom of the deck, ten of wands. Okay, uh, this is um, a lot of bur this is a burden here, ten of wands, but it's a ten, so tens are completion cycles have completed or this cycle has, it's a transformation. Butterflies are always transformation. Somebody had a point to prove, maybe. You know, they had a chip on their shoulder. And unfortunately, you were in their sights for some reason. But it's coming to an end here, okay? Could have been uh, messy here. You see the roses here? They smell sweet. They look beautiful. But see the, the brambles? It's all mushed together. The, it's untangling things I think something's been tangled up it's it, now we have it's time to untangle everything uh, things are changing right cull culling you know somebody had something to prove here I don't think they're, they're going to be successful with this at all I don't think they are at all nope putting down these burdens are, are, are crushing so much somebody's being crushed underneath these burdens so that was bottom of the deck, wasn't it? Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, white light. Why is the knight of wands in the reverse and the two of wands in the upright? Thank you, spirit. The star. Somebody's healed. You've healed from this beautifully. You're divinely protected and divinely guided. Listen to your gut. Listen to your... In oh, sorry, I keep doing that. Listen to your gut. Listen to your in intuition. You're well balanced with emotionally, by the way. You can see half, half in the water, half out. All right. This could also be you're in the limelight here, but your your stars shining, your stars rising. This is wish fulfillment, okay? Or maybe you're their wish fulfillment. Take it as it applies. Bottom of the deck, devil. They're obsessed here. Could be an obsession. Um, could be addictions, obsessions, temptations, greed, jealousy, anything that binds a person, okay? Anything that stops a person from living a good and healthy life, 
prevents them from moving forward, right? Could be a karmic for all we know. Just jealousy. Jealousy is a uh, very insidious disease, isn't it? I call it a disease. Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, the white light. Why is the star card here? Please me up, right? Two of Pentacles. Somebody's making a decision. Somebody's needing more clarity upon a situation. They can't make a decision just yet. They're trying to keep things aligned. Um, they, maybe they got too many things going at once. They're juggling people or money. Oh, yeah. That's maybe their wish fulfillment, right? Juggle, juggle. Maybe they think they're so hot and they brag to their friends, look how many people I've got, how many notches I've got. Who knows? But this could be weighing options. This could be um, making a head over heart decision, right? Speaking the truth, King of Swords. This person, this could be a police officer. This could be a, an officer of the courts, a, a lawyer, a judge, an investigator, a doctor, anybody that's in a professional field such as that, that kind of oversees and makes decisions for other people. This energy is generally very factual. They, they work on facts, not on, on emotions, not on hearsay. They make decisions. They're very strategic. They think things through. They're very, very intelligent. Um, could be military as well, okay? Somebody's either they're going to be speaking the truth. They have the sword of truth with them. And if it's not a professional, it's just somebody here is going to be speaking their truth. Yep. Yeah. Very professional, very factual, very good with their words, very communicative, right? Um, articulate. Bottom of the deck, three of pentacles. So it could be a contract here. Could be a third party, could be a collaboration. Maybe they want to come work with you. I don't know. Try to make something grow, right? Or they see they might be seeing that you're making something grow, you know. You're successful, maybe, and they want in. We'll see where this goes. Or maybe you planted some seeds in the past and brought the truth out about a situation. If it, if this is corruption, maybe you've planted some seeds and you helped. Bring this to an end. King of Swords. What's King of Swords here in the upright? Let's bring this to close spirit, please. Thank you. Ten of Wands is in the reverse this time. Yeah, putting down burdens now. Oh, yeah. Somebody's made a conscious decision to speak their truth. They want to change their life for the better, do better, be better, put these burdens down. Most of these burdens do not belong to them. Again, I put her in reverse, 10, 10 of cups in reverse, and so not emotionally fulfilled or happy where they are. Could have been a scapegoat, somebody scapegoated someone, okay? Could have been an organization, some sort of group, some crime group or crime family, family card, right? Yeah, they're not happy. And leave that there, 10, 10. If that resonates with you, this could be for you. Why is it 10 of Wands in reverse, ten of cups in reverse, spirit. Oh, that was quick. Yeah. Well, there's no love or emotion in this cup, right? It's upside down. This could be emotional, though. This could be emotional ending. Um, no love loss here. That could be it, too. Not a gift from the divine, that's for sure. Bottom of the deck, moon. There are a lot of lies and secrets and illusions here. It could be fear, okay? This person's really fearing, maybe. Maybe they have to testify in a court of law, speak the truth, right? Maybe somebody's, um, test, you know, somebody's going to be testifying against their, I don't know. Take it as it applies. The moon suggests that there's been a lot of lies and illusions. There's been, uh, not, n nothing was as it seemed, Okay. They could have been threatened. Okay, this person is in the flesh here looking in the water, reflection. They could have been threatened with death, so they have no choice. Either do what they're doing or die, right? They're scared, right? Or maybe they're using listening to their intuition. It's a great intuition card. And they're, they're following their gut, bottom of the deck. 
poor judgment, right? This is harsh judgment against the person or, or situation. Somebody wasn't awake. They weren't aware. They lacked judgment here. They don't want to take accountability or they didn't. They're getting some bad karma here. Definitely. Lack of awareness, lack of acceptance, lack of accountability. Well, they're getting karma. They're scared. They're scared. Moon in the upright. Let's close this down spirit. Why is this here? Thank you. Three of wands. Um, they're turning their backs on whatever this was. They're not going back. Um, they could be traveling here. It could be witness protection. That's what I heard in my head. Here's some plans. Here's maybe, I don't know, a package of some sort. I don't know how they do this, um, how the feds do that, but uh, here's a package. You move on. They're not turning back. They're waiting for the ships to come in. They could be at a distance. Take it as it applies. They're letting go. They can't, they can't turn back. Five of Pentacles out in the cold. Yeah, they're alone. Could be a, a very lonely existence right now. Somebody walked over a lot of people here, okay? There could have been, I hate to say it, there could have been some deaths involved. But somebody walked on a lot of people here, so they better run. They better go. If the feds tell you to go, go. Don't come back. It might be a, a lonely existence, but at least you're still alive. Um, not telling you what to do, okay? I'm just saying, right? Somebody's out in the cold, though. Out of luck. Three of wands in the upright. A lack of confidence, too, right? The tower in reverse. Everything's ruined. This is a big shake-up, a big shock. This is the universe coming in and doing it. Lights out. The candle went out again. Uh, five of wands. There's conflict here. There's fighting. There's drama. Yeah. Could have, uh, look at this. Light in the match here. So maybe it's arson or something. You know how some um, some corrupt people do things for insurance. Just saying, fire. Um, yeah, take it as it applies. So maybe a structure came down because of a fire. It's an arson. Eight of cups, somebody walking away here. Yep, eight of cups in the upright. There's no emotional fulfillment or happiness here. They wanted to walk away from something that they invested in for a long time. I mean, they invested eight cups out of ten. That's a lot of money, time, energy. Emotion, whatever this is, if it is a building, a, a business, something like that, they want to walk away from it. So I think they did something illegal so they wouldn't lose their money. So it's probably a failing business. Five of swords in reverse. Yeah, this is uh, disgraceful. They want to put this behind them. Five of swords in reverse. Could have had some people gunning for them, right? The, the, this is also um, um, holding a grudge. Seven of Pentacles. This is an investment. You get what you give with this card, okay? Yeah, somebody underestimated somebody. This is an investment. Um, invested seven Pentacles out of ten. Um, could be waiting for some. They have evidence. They have somebody has evidence here. Yeah, could be waiting for evidence. Waiting for some results of some sort. Counting heads here, right? Maybe they're going to be squealing on seven people. Take it as it applies. Emperor, big boss. You know what I'm saying? See the gun? Yeah, I think this has to do with corruption. Somebody's heartbroken. Yeah, could be a father, but um, yeah, I think it's maybe somebody that's at the head of something. There's heartbreak here. There's regrets. Definite regrets. There's been knives put in somebody's back. Maybe this person... I don't know. I can't say for sure. You know, it's, it looks like somebody put knives in people's backs to get on top. To get to where they are. And now, I think their little kingdom is crumbling. They're out in the cold, right? Yep, Five of Pentacles again. Four of Cups. They targeted people that of value, seized an opportunity. If it's not targeting people of value, they yeah, seized an opportunity, right? And now there's a judgment against them, possibly in court. If not in court, up above, right? Judgment in the upright. Everybody knows what they're all about now. 
Mm -hmm. This could be just a, a, this is a wake up call for somebody. This could be a spiritual awakening as well. <clears throat> yeah. Somebody, we're going to leave it there. It's a judgment against somebody. Judgment's been called. So we're going to leave it there. Uh, <clears throat> Spirit says to leave it there. Maybe we're not meant to know the outcome just yet. Maybe it's still in transition. I don't know. Spirit guides, starting angels, ancestors, the white light. How does this fit in? Wisdom, power of the divine. So the divine's got a, a hand in this. The sword and the rose, clarity, truth, revelation. See? Solidarity, force, honor, protection, and power. So somebody's going into protect, uh, protective services, I think. Interested, conversing more. Awaited message arrives. Text, call, email, hoovering. So somebody's watching over hoovering. It's, yeah, hoovering, FBI, duh. Somebody's watching over somebody. Okay. Yeah. This definitely, that's, that's, uh, yeah, I got chills. It's confirmation. This is what's going on. Whoever this is, um, well, I don't know. I don't, I don't deal in this world, so I don't know. Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, the white light, what are your messages? Closing this reading out, please, for Monday, April 25th, 2022. There's two of them. Oh, boy. What do we got? Poised in reverse, 48, 4, and 8 is 12. It's hangman in reverse, arrest. To be fair, in reverse, 3 and 8 is 11. Injustice in reverse. So a crime's been committed here. I'll read both, and there's just the... Um, uh, protection message, by the way, since it's in the reverse. So 48 and 38. Isn't that odd? Okay. Uh, just a second. Bear with me, please. 47, of course. 49. Protection for 48 for poised in reverse. You're not ready to move forward at this time, and that has to be okay. Be poised in the face of demands and deadlines. Pretending you know what you're doing works sometimes, but if you adopt a fake it till you make it attitude, it'll land you in some muck now. This is not the time to wing it and deliver something half finished. It's okay to postpone things until you're really ready. It's better to disappoint others now than to wish you had later. I don't know how that fits in. Maybe it's testimonies. I don't know. So we'll do the uh, 38 in reverse now. Oh, 28 figures. <laughs> 32. If you like the message, please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it. So we have protection message here for 38, which is to be fair. Injustice and inequity are part of life, but they do not have to define your experience. This is a time when you may observe an injustice righted and fairly redressed. Exactly what we're talking about. Perhaps you come to the rescue of someone else or a call to answer for a personal slight. You will be amazed by the sense of power that surges through you when you stand up for yourself and others. This card also indicates a good time to advocate for others who are less fortunate. Choose your cause and commit to it because you can make a difference. One thing's for certain, if, if, if fairness is your intention, the situation will be resolved for the highest good of all concerned through acts of kindness, empathy, and courage. So, again, I got chills. That is your message. Whoever's doing this, you got big balls, I'll tell you that much. Male or female, I, I could never imagine being in your shoes, but good on you. Um, have a pure heart, do it, don't, don't, yeah. You know, if you're doing it for the, all the right reasons, you will be successful, okay? Spirit's on your side. So until next time, take care.